Hi guys, today we're in a 325, uh, 2005 325 CI. We're gonna show you how to install a uh, dash mount. Now, pretty much dash mount, it just goes behind this panel and then it gives you a mounting point to, to mount something. Uh, so, you know, in this, in this case, we're just gonna mount the universal holder. Um, first step to taking it out is gonna pop out this panel. Um, I'm gonna do it real time. If you look at this panel, these are my PPT12345 five panel tools. All right, now the difference between these and the, uh, this set's pretty cheap. Well, not cheap, it's, we pretty much give it away the price, but the difference is that our, our kits, when you go to put them in, they don't flex as much as the other ones. So some of the cheaper ones that I've seen other videos do, you could tell they've been fighting them for hours because, you know, they flex. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna come in here and it's gonna pry outwards. All right, it's gonna, All right, use your fingers too. Nice, I love when people have new cars that haven't been touched. All right. That one's always a pain, so I'm just gonna go on the other side, open the door. All right, this one's always a pain because it's on the end. So, just always come out here. All right, so as you can see here, these clips over here, they go into these plastic pieces. And then what these plastic pieces, if you look inside, they have metal. So that's why it's important to pry out because if you try to yank out this way, what they're gonna do is they're gonna catch on the plastic pieces, on the metal inside. Cause like, I don't know if you can see in the video, but inside of there, there's a little metal. So it's plastic, but it's metal inside. So I just pried out and it came out nice. I'm not gonna lie, it doesn't always come out that nice. Sometimes you do have to fight with it a little bit, um, you know. Or sometimes someone's tried to pry it out before, and then by the time you get in there and try to do it, you know, it's it's a, it's a, it's already, the damage has been done. But just take your time, pry straight out. Uh, this is PPT5, this is the wide one. Our kit includes two of them. This one's more for hard pry, this is more for, you know, all right? So let me show you how to take out the uh, one over the radio. All right guys, so now we're moved on to here. Um, this piece actually, if you look at it, it's held in with the other clip, and then there's one more over here. So what we're gonna do is just gonna go straight, oop, wrong panel. Use the wide one, not the little one. All right, I'm gonna go right over here, and we're just gonna pry straight out. See, if you pry straight out, that comes right out. It's when you disturb it that you have issues. All right, see it? That came right out, perfect. We're gonna show you how the, the Panavice 7.5 103.599 fits. What it does is that goes right here. It gives you somewhere to mount your devices. Um, so what it is, this one you use with the device holder, allows you to hold your phone or your navigation or something. So what you need to take off that 10 millimeter socket, I mean bolt, put this back in. Go over here. And actually wiggle it down a little bit, make sure it's flat. See how it's flat with the grooves? All right, this, you can get the, the phone holders to go into the vents, but then for A, you're gonna scratch your vents, and B, you might break them. Um, and no one wants that. And this is actually, it's prettier. It's nicer on the eye. Nicer on the eye. It has a four hole bolt patterns, multiple ones for different holders. Um, and then what are we gonna do here? Okay, so we just put that back on. So now I'm gonna put this piece back on. All right, this goes right over it. Now, let me see if I can put this on from here without reaching over to the other side. Yeah. All right, and then pretty much just have to bang that in. All right. And then that's it, voila. Just wipe it down. All right. Now that's the Panavice. Now let me... Uh, let me take some good pictures of this for the website and then I'll come back and I'll show you guys how to uh, put the holder on there. Hi guys, Christian over at Enfit Car Stereo. Some of you are continuing the Panavice 75103599 video in a 2005-2006 BMW 3 Series. Uh, the rest of you are watching our custom mount video. Um, this is a universal mount. This is our entry level, low priced, universal, hold everything mount, okay? A lot of you guys, the industry's changed a lot. A lot of you guys are now realizing that phones are changing and you're swapping back and forth.
especially Verizon and uh, AT&T, they all started that whole um, swap your phone sooner than later thing. So now, this is a universal holder. If you look at this, it has the thing in the middle. Make sure that faces upwards. All right, so we're gonna do one screw. All right, and then it's gonna be the nut behind it. Oops. Uh, I'm doing these hand tight right now just to get them all on. We got two. Do I always do one at a time because I feel that when I do four and then try to, you know, put all four under the screws, my finger will hit one, and then next thing you know, we are uh, digging through the car looking for nuts and bolts. This way, even though it takes a long time, at least you're in control. Once we got that. I should actually fast forward and put some Benny Hill music here. You guys that know who Benny Hill is. You youngsters who don't know who Benny Hill is. Who Benny Hill is. Um, a lot of people probably got a lot of cues from him. All right. All right, I'm gonna tighten those better, but just for the sake of the video, um, I'm just gonna show you. So I don't have to sit here and you wait for me to get a wrench. I mean a socket. All right, so this goes here. All right, now if I'm using, we just installed the device, if I'm using that device, the Samsung S4, it ain't going nowhere. All right, and if we're doing the iPod, with the iPod cable from the bottom, iPhone 5, iPhone whatever you got, all right? It is brought to you by nfitcarstereo.com. We sell and install. We also ship worldwide. If you're a shop, we also do dealer accounts and we know our stuff so better than most people when it comes to integration. Nfitcarstereo, my name is Christian. Thank you for watching.